what's up guys so part two of destroyers um update let's go straight ahead for the water skills so this time for water guys let's check water i forgot about this though but yeah nothing changed nothing changed for the water in for old as i think because but I'm not sure about this attribute attack conversion ratio increases. Yeah, I think nothing changed except for this one that I don't understand. Next is flying charge. Flying charge. Nothing changed for water. Roll. It's the same. And... If you watch our last, uh, the part one of this is the dodge, I mean the, the dash is fixed already that you don't slow down over time. You will maintain your um, speed like this. So let's go to the next skill. Um, yeah, punishment wave. It did not change range bomb water no change yep no change source of power no change of course still the same but let's try let's try should equip it first so yes it still drains our HP, I mean shield, or barrier. Then let's turn it off. So it's still bad for me, of, co of course, because I don't want my shield to be depleting. Next is rolling attack. Did something change here? Nothing. Did not change at all. This enchanting shout. Flying impact. Oh, this one is a buff. Uh, I think this enchanting shout is buffed. The, the flying impact is reset. Oh, once you use this, this fly is flying impact. Oh, flying? This is flying charge. What is flying impact? I suppose that is flying charge will reset. Okay, this one is um, buffed because. Um, Flying charge replenish your shield by 4% of max HP. So it's better if you cast this before you cast this. Okay. So I, I think my rotation uh, later, later. We're gonna talk about the rotation later. Yeah, Highlander, nothing. So the this one is a big issue for me. A lot of uh, players thought that um, water destroyers are stronger than dark destroyer now I would say the opposite because yes you will be so strong now because of this buff but you lose the immunity so um, before the update uh, water destroyers are for me my uh, humble opinion for me it's a uh, Water destroyers are very good in PvE versus um, dark destroyers. And then they are bad at PvP versus destroy, uh, dark destroyers. Now they have become much more better in PvE versus dark destroyers. And for PvP, they have become trash because of the immunity, guys. For me, they have become trash. Um, you will be like uh because of no immunity you will be like uh, uh, a weakling inside a stampede when it go it when it comes to um pvp or like guild boss or anything like with the pvp content you must stay away from those content because you won't have immunity anymore Plus, you're draining your HP. 
let's equip this first I want to show you something oh yeah so yeah because you don't have the immunity anymore guys um, see no more shield the shields are gone no more immunity when your HP is low so it means while you are casting this very slow skill lots of your skills are very slow guys you are very open open you are very open to lots of attacks from players so yeah you will be you will get wrecked very hard so i would say this is a a heavy nerf for water destroyer so i think yeah they are trash now just for me guys charging roar nope uh, yeah this one could help you maybe but for 10 seconds only yeah 10 seconds maelstrom how water after the skills release you oh okay five percent of yours so before update i remember this maelstrom howl was um after you cast this as a water um you get damage reduction 20 percent for 15 seconds now it's only uh it gives you five percent of your own shield regen so i don't think it's good because of the cooldown guys it's 30 seconds i'd prefer the the damage reduction for 15 seconds rather than five percent uh shield regen so i think this is a nerf for me next is this i haven't checked this one oh yeah it's still the same yeah, it still rep replenish your uh, shield by 5%. So yeah, I think water destroyers, for me guys, they are tra more trash than ever. <laughs> if you think they are stronger than dark destroyers now, I would say no. Because of um, no immunity. But yes, you get more more damage because of the um fast cooldowns so maybe you can do it for uh, layers or any pve content targets that doesn't touch you or um cancel your attacks yeah i would say yes they are strong but yeah pvp trash so yeah that's it for this vid Thank you guys for watching. God bless you all. Stay safe. Love and peace. Bye bye.